A wormhole, also known as an Einstein-Rosen bridge, is a hypothetical concept in physics that describes a wormhole as a tunnel or a shortcut through space-time that connects two distant regions of the universe. Imagine space-time as a fabric, with massive objects such as planets and stars creating dips or curves in the fabric. These dips in the fabric of space-time are what we experience as gravity. Now, imagine folding this fabric so that two distant points in space-time come together. This is the basic idea behind a wormhole. It's a shortcut that allows you to travel between two points in space-time without actually traveling the distance between them. The concept of wormholes is based on the theory of general relativity, which was proposed by Albert Einstein in 1915. According to this theory, gravity is not a force between two objects but rather a curvature in space-time caused by massive objects. This curvature in space-time is what causes planets to orbit around stars and moons to orbit around planets. In the case of a wormhole, the curvature of space-time is so extreme that it creates a tunnel or a shortcut between two distant points in space-time. The mouth of a wormhole can be thought of as a funnel that leads to a tunnel through space-time. To enter the wormhole, one must pass through the mouth and travel through the tunnel to reach the other end. Wormholes are divided into two categories, traversable and non-traversable. A traversable wormhole is one that can be crossed without being destroyed by intense gravitational forces. A non-traversable wormhole, on the other hand, is one that collapses in on itself before anything can pass through it. To stabilize a wormhole and prevent it from collapsing, scientists have proposed the use of exotic matter, a hypothetical substance with negative energy density. Exotic matter is thought to possess negative mass and negative energy, which would allow it to counteract the effects of normal matter and create a stable wormhole. The ability to travel faster than light and travel through time could revolutionize space exploration and open up new possibilities for scientific research. However, the challenges of building a wormhole are immense. One of the biggest challenges is the requirement for exotic matter, which has never been observed in nature and is purely theoretical. The theory of general relativity is a cornerstone of modern physics and was proposed by Albert Einstein in 1915. It describes gravity as the curvature of space-time, where massive objects cause a distortion in the fabric of space-time. The curvature of space-time around massive objects can cause a phenomenon known as time dilation, where time appears to move slower in stronger gravitational fields. In other words, the theory of general relativity suggests that gravity is not a force between two objects, but rather a consequence of the curvature of space-time caused by massive objects. This idea is fundamental to our understanding of wormholes because it implies that massive objects can create distortions in space-time that may allow for shortcuts or tunnels through space-time. Einstein's theory of general relativity also predicts the existence of black holes, which are regions in space where the gravitational pull is so strong that nothing, not even light, can escape. The concept of black holes is closely related to the idea of wormholes because both involve extreme distortions in the fabric of space-time. One of the most intriguing aspects of general relativity is the phenomenon of time dilation. This is the idea that time can appear to move slower in regions of strong gravitational fields. For example, time moves slower on the surface of a massive planet than it does in deep space, where there is no gravity. This phenomenon has been observed in experiments involving atomic clocks placed at different altitudes on Earth. The idea of time dilation is particularly relevant to wormholes because it implies that traveling through a wormhole could potentially allow for time travel. If one end of a wormhole is located near a massive object like a black hole, time dilation could cause time to move slower near the black hole than in other parts of the universe. This means that someone traveling through a wormhole could potentially travel back in time or forward in time, depending on the relative time dilation at each end of the wormhole. Wormholes are theoretical constructs that connect two distant regions of space-time, allowing for faster-than-light travel and the possibility of time travel. There are two types of wormholes, traversable and non-traversable. A traversable wormhole is one that can be crossed without being destroyed by intense gravitational forces. In order for a wormhole to be traversable, it must have a shape that is stable enough to withstand the forces that would otherwise collapse it. This means that the shape of the wormhole must be carefully balanced between the attractive force of gravity and the repulsive force of exotic matter. 
Exotic matter is a theoretical substance that has negative energy density and negative pressure. It is necessary for the creation and stabilization of traversable wormholes because it can generate the repulsive force needed to counterbalance the attractive force of gravity. However, exotic matter is purely hypothetical and has never been observed in nature. Traversable wormholes have been explored in science fiction as a means of faster than light travel and time travel. However, they are purely theoretical constructs and have not been observed in reality. On the other hand, a non-traversable wormhole is one that collapses in on itself before anything can pass through it. This is because the gravitational forces involved in the formation of a non-traversable wormhole are so strong that they exceed the repulsive force generated by exotic matter. As a result, the wormhole collapses before it can be crossed. Non-traversable wormholes are still of interest to scientists because they provide insight into the properties of space-time and the behavior of gravity. However, they cannot be used for practical purposes such as faster-than-light travel or time travel. The mechanics of a wormhole involve the bending of space-time to create a shortcut between two distant regions of space. This bending of space-time is caused by the presence of massive objects such as stars, black holes, and other celestial bodies. In the presence of such massive objects, space-time becomes curved, and the curvature of space-time is what creates the phenomenon of gravity. The idea of a wormhole is based on the theory of general relativity proposed by Albert Einstein in 1915. According to this theory, gravity is not a force between two objects, but rather a curvature of space-time caused by the presence of massive objects. This curvature of space-time can be visualized as a rubber sheet that is stretched and distorted by the weight of a heavy object placed on it. The heavier the object, the greater the curvature of the rubber sheet. In the case of a wormhole, the curvature of space-time is so extreme that it creates a tunnel or shortcut between two distant regions of space. The mouth of a wormhole can be thought of as a funnel that leads to a tunnel through space-time. To enter the wormhole, one must pass through the mouth and travel through the tunnel to reach the other end. However, a wormhole is not a static object that exists in space like a planet or a star. Rather, it is a dynamic structure that constantly changes as the objects around it move and interact with it. In order for a wormhole to be traversable, it must be stabilized by exotic matter, which generates a repulsive force that counterbalances the attractive force of gravity. This exotic matter is purely theoretical and has never been observed in nature. Despite the theoretical nature of wormholes, they have captured the imagination of scientists and science fiction writers alike. Traversable wormholes have been explored as a means of faster-than-light travel and time travel, although the practicality of such travel remains unknown. One of the most fascinating aspects of wormholes is the possibility of time travel. The theory of general relativity suggests that the curvature of space-time around a wormhole can create a time loop that allows for time travel. This means that if one end of a wormhole is located in the past and the other end is located in the future, travel through the wormhole could result in time travel. Travel. The concept of time travel through wormholes involves entering the mouth of the wormhole and traveling through the tunnel to the other end. If the other end of the wormhole is located in the past, then one could theoretically travel back in time. If the other end of the wormhole is located in the future, then one could theoretically travel to the future. However, the concept of time travel through wormholes is purely theoretical and has never been observed in nature. Additionally, the concept of time travel raises many paradoxes and logical inconsistencies, such as the grandfather paradox. The grandfather paradox is a paradox in which a time traveler goes back in time and kills their own grandfather before their parent is born, thereby preventing their own birth. This paradox raises questions about the causality and consistency of time travel. Furthermore, the physics of wormholes suggests that they are highly unstable and prone to collapsing. The use of exotic matter to stabilize the wormhole and prevent it from collapsing is purely theoretical and has never been observed in nature. As a result, the possibility of time travel through wormholes remains highly speculative and uncertain. Building a wormhole is a daunting task that poses several challenges. The first and perhaps the most significant challenge of building a wormhole is the requirement for exotic matter. As previously mentioned, exotic matter is a hypothetical substance with negative energy density, which is thought to counteract the effects of normal matter and create a stable wormhole. 
However, exotic matter has never been observed in nature, and its existence is purely theoretical. This means that even if we had the technology to create a wormhole, we would still need to figure out a way to create and use exotic matter. The second challenge of building a wormhole is the immense amount of energy required to stabilize the wormhole and keep it open. The creation and stabilization of a wormhole would require vast amounts of energy, which is currently beyond our technological capabilities. The energy required to stabilize a wormhole would need to be greater than the energy output of an entire star, which is a staggering amount of energy. Another challenge of building a wormhole is the stability of the wormhole. Wormholes are highly unstable and prone to collapsing, which means that we would need to find a way to stabilize the wormhole and prevent it from collapsing. As previously mentioned, the use of exotic matter is one possible way to stabilize a wormhole. However, as exotic matter is purely theoretical, we would need to find other ways to stabilize a wormhole. In addition to these challenges, there are also numerous technical challenges that must be overcome, such as the engineering and construction of a wormhole, the safe passage of objects through the wormhole, and the prevention of paradoxes and other unintended consequences that may arise from the use of a wormhole. If we could create a stable and traversable wormhole, we could potentially travel vast distances in a relatively short amount of time. This would revolutionize space exploration and open up new possibilities for scientific research. For example, we could send spacecraft through a wormhole to explore distant galaxies and observe objects that would otherwise be impossible to observe with current technology. Another significant implication of wormholes is the possibility of time travel. If we could travel through a wormhole, we could potentially travel back in time or to the future. This would have significant implications for our understanding of the universe and could potentially answer some of the most fundamental questions in physics, such as the nature of the Big Bang and the ultimate fate of the universe. The creation of a stable and traversable wormhole could also have implications for interstellar communication. If we could send messages through a wormhole, we could potentially communicate with other civilizations in distant galaxies and exchange information that would otherwise be impossible to transmit with current technology. In addition to these implications, the creation of a wormhole would also have implications for our understanding of the fundamental laws of physics. The existence of a stable and traversable wormhole would require the existence of exotic matter, which would fundamentally alter our understanding of the universe and the laws that govern it. While the concept of wormholes is purely theoretical, the implications of wormholes could be profound. The possibility of faster-than-light travel and time travel opens up new avenues for scientific research and could have a profound impact on our understanding of the universe. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more.